Are we rolling this far? What's up guys? It's from the Crane here. Today I'm going to be doing my spoiler free movie review of Color Out of Space. This is a um, uh, sci-fi drama horror movie that stars Nicolas Cage as Nathan Gardiner, um, who is a uh, who's a farmer who, you know, you know, has a family and has a wife with cancer. And, uh, well, one day a meteorite lands in his yard and an organism from the meteorite, an alien organism from the meteorite, you know, comes out and like, you know, starts like controlling everybody's minds and taking over everybody's bodies. You can't really see it, it's like in the air, well actually you can see it, it's just, you can see, it's like just a cloud of color, like you can see it but it's just a cloud of color, the organism is a cloud of color, it's like a colored air or whatever, which is why they call it color out of space by the way, um, anyway he does Nicholas Cage does a fantastic, over-the-top job as playing Nathan Gardiner. I, he was the, out of all of the cast members, like, he was, he did the best job. He was awesome. Anyway, so this movie was actually based on, like, a, uh, a 60s, like, short story. Um, I, I never read the short story. But I, I heard of it and stuff. I've heard of it and stuff. And, uh, I know that it's by the same guy who wrote the Call of Cthulhu or whatever. I never read that one either, but who doesn't know about that book or whatever. Anyway, so this movie, it's a, uh, it's just a fantastic, thrilling movie. Um, it's just, it's like a nail biter. You know, like, uh, the first 20 minutes are like, you know, just character, full of just character development and exposition and stuff. Well, not really exposition, just character development. They're not really like, you know... Like, the meteorite doesn't really land in their yard until, like, uh, 30 minutes into the movie. But, you know, I like the character development. Everything in here is, uh, awesome. I mean, it's just great. You know, this movie, it's, it's not a masterpiece, but it is a great movie. And it can be shocking at times like shocking just like oh my gosh like I can't believe it like oh my gosh I, I can't believe that this actually happened what's gonna happen you know it's just a it was a really thrilling awesome movie that was worth my time worth every moment of my time and I loved it I love it it's just great and like that's not the only and just to point out, like, you know, most of, most, most of the shots in this movie, like, you know, the frames, frame by frame, are, like, masterpieces of, like, art, or, like, pieces of art, like, you know what I'm saying, like, this movie has, like, amazing cinematography, edi editing, like, you know, like, coloring, CG, you know, um... I'm just going to show you guys a picture from a scene and just just to show you like how 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 just like satisfying it is to look at the color. Like the color is basically just eye candy. It's just the color is awesome. It's just awesome to look at. It's so satisfying. I just you know, it's supposed to be like the color is like evil in the movie, if you know what I mean. But, like, it's just so flippin' satisfying to look at when you're watching the movie. 
See, let me just show you guys a picture. Anyway, I would definitely recommend this movie. Unless, you know, you... This, well, I have to say, this is a horror movie, technically. And this, this movie does get very intense at certain times. So, if you're not, like, into horror movies or that kind of thing, then, you know... Of course, of course I don't recommend you watching this because you're not into this, that kind of stuff. But like, you know, if you're into that specific genre of movie, of like movies, if you know what I mean, and you love this movie, my bad. <clears throat> okay, I meant to say, and if you love like, you know, if you love over the top Nicolas Cage, and like, you know, sci-fi movies and stuff like that, like I do, you know, I I love this kind of thing. But I know that certain people don't, so just trying to like, you know, warn you just in case you're just like, oh, this is gonna be like, you know, just like a comedy or something, or like a drama. No, it's, it's, it's a horror movie, guys. <laughs> well, it's not like, you know, like a slasher or anything, but like, you know, it's technically a horror movie. Um, anyway, I'm going to give this movie an 87% out of 100%, which is the equivalent of an A-. minus. Like, subscribe, join the notification squad, and if you've seen this movie, tell me down below in the comments what you thought of it. Did you like it? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Did you slightly dislike it? Did you have mixed feelings about it or think it was okay? Tell me down below. I will return.